One of our new Harvest of the Month winter squash recipes is a yogurt parfait with butternut squash and cranberries. And I really love this one because it's a great chance to use some awesome local ingredients. And it's also a really neat way to use up winter squash, which is a vegetable, well, which we think of as a vegetable. It's actually a fruit, but it's in more of a sweet um, dish, which is exciting. So I've got here our butternut squash that has been peeled and diced, and we have a short video on how to do that, so check it out for this recipe. And then I roasted it in the oven with a little bit of olive oil and some main maple syrup, some salt, and some cinnamon. Um, and so now they're all done and they've cooled. You really wanna make sure that they cool or else it's gonna kind of um, mess up the layers here. And then I've got a um, Maine yogurt, Milk House, they're in Monmouth, Maine. They have awesome um, yogurt. This one is a maple flavored. They have maple, they have wild Maine blueberry, they have regular and they have Greek. And the cool thing is a lot of schools in Maine are using their yogurt because they also come in big five gallon, I think it's five gallon, but big buckets um, at a really great price. So that's an awesome local ingredient. And essentially what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna build a little parfait here. Um, the recipe that we created definitely has an, an order that you want to do it in, or that it tells you to do it in, but you don't really have to. Um, and I just chose a couple of sort of fun little dishes here, but you're, want to, you're going to want to use an eight ounce cup in your kitchens. So I'm going to take this yogurt, give it a stir, and I'm going to use half a cup of yogurt. Beautiful. And then I'm going to use one ounce of granola. Like that. And if you're doing like a taller eight ounce cup, these will be nice layers, but I'm going to do them kind of um, lined up. I think that'll look really pretty in this wider bowl. And then I'm going to do um, half a cup of the cooked and cooled maple roasted butter squash. Super delicious. And when I diced these, I did kind of like, um, smaller pieces and they got really nice and caramelized and browned up that looks awesome and then an eighth of a cup of dried cranberries um, and you know there's a lot of there's some sweetness here of course this is maple so it's a, a sweetened yogurt um, there's the maple syrup a little bit of maple syrup in the in the cooked squash there but um, dried cranberries also have a decent amount of sugar so don't be thinking that this is like a, some weird savory parfait. This is definitely a great breakfast. Uh, there's lots of whole grains from the, the granola and um, protein in the yogurt. And it is an awesome, um, especially this time of year, fall breakfast to serve your kids.